Hello, this is Lynn talking for Astrophony International Astrology Network and for perceptivity.co.uk, home of metaphysical astrology. This is the overview for Leo for January to May 2016. Leo Sun. The first Mercury retrograde motion this year in January begins in your opposing sign, Aquarius but almost immediately backs into Capricorn. This signifies that there are certain matters which require more contact or connection and you're advised to measure the reasons and facts before communication is worthwhile. This is probably in the area of work or vocation, but for many of you, it will be concerned with loyalties of various kinds or possibly of a miscellaneous nature. Now that Saturn is into the fire sign of Sagittarius, very different in nature to your own fire sign, you may see that you should ignore limitations of the past two or three years, which were fear-based, and move to more adventurous ground from where you may get a better stronghold on satisfaction in some way that enriches life. This may take some doing and some daring, but the last months of 2015 have signalled the way for you if you can summon the courage and energy and make it happen. The Mercury retrograde motions this year are four in all, and the first one mentioned before is the one which starts off the train of events leading to a fresh door or option to your world. The second Mercury retrograde motion is in Taurus in late April and will bring the need for some coalescence or seeing eye to eye with others and trusting them with urges or ideas that are personal to you but that you cannot pull off alone. By the time Mars has made a conjunction to Saturn in Sagittarius in August and Mercury and Venus are in Virgo, along with Jupiter, you might begin to realise that your finances and the resources needed are not something which are outside of your scope, but well within range once you plan and prune your existing budget. The possibilities you envisaged in the latter half of 2015 and the expectancy you allowed yourself to feel if you were brave enough and now turning to areas of potential fulfillment based on changes which are, are unheard of perhaps until the early spring. Most Leo people are due to get a reality check this year. They have been either dreaming or they've been designing. That is to say, they've been looking at the results and not the means, unless they have understood that even if they cannot reach exactly what it is they want, they can make a path of alternative ways. Overcoming the lack or sterility in certain areas of their lives and attaining things which make life a pleasure for more of the time. It differs from person to person, but Leos are born knowing innately that life without this special factor is fruitless. So the latter half of 2016 is the time when the balance is precarious, but must be weighed between the various paths of everyday choice which make a future. The final Mercury retrograde motion is again in Capricorn in December, and it completes the loop from where the intentions and motivations began in January and where these end up taking you as the year folds. Of course, there is a lot of year to go yet, and the plan has to come together. The map follows the intention and the intention is based on the focus, which is why the emissions or oversights noticed, noticed in January must be dealt with for the direction to be correct as the train of events rolls out. Join us for the next update in May. And if you would like more details about the astrology service I provide, then please visit us at www.perceptivity.co.uk Thank you. Bu akşam seminerimizi canlı olarak mobil uygulamamız üzerinden yapıyoruz.